Hello everyone, this is Tracy. A um, couple of things. I'm coming on today to show you uh, my entry into Kay's challenge. That's Kazzy Kins One is her YouTube channel. Um, she's having a challenge giveaway um, and you had to make four little note cards and also a um, little mini album out of one sheet of 12 by 12 cardstock. Um, the actual deadline is tomorrow, so these are going out in first class post today. And also, just to let you know that I've actually changed my channel name. Um, it's now Tracy Cambridge Craft Cabin. So just to let you know that changed. I was 853 Twinkle previous, still the same person. Um, I just wanted it, you know, to reflect more of me, really. So without further ado, uh, like I said, we had to make four little note cards. So these are the ones that I've made. Um, I did make some vintage ones to start with um, and then I changed my mind. So um, what I've made here are little shaker cards. Um, basically what I did, I loaded up, um, I think it was six or seven layers of a stitch circle frame. Well, I made it into a frame die um, with some clear acetate. Um, I used a flamingo die that's this one here. Um, I actually purchased this from Joe's Crafty Pad over on Facebook. Um, these little leaf die cuts, I used an unbranded die um, that I bought. I think it was from AliExpress actually, and there was four parts to this, um, so I used those. Um, the Aloha was um, stamped out i haven't actually got that stamp set to, ha to hand and uh, the little shaker elements um these i actually received or i actually bought from the trinket parlor over on facebook and they're like little flower sequins they're really really tiny really really glittery and as you'll see i've also put those on there and i also use some flat back um blings and again i got these from joe Joe's Crafty Pad over on Facebook. Um, the paper I've used in the background, um, it's the first edition Paradise Crush. And again, I got this from Joe's Crafty Pad. Um, so yeah, I mean, I thought these were rather, make you all feel sick now, rather fun. Um, really enjoyed making these. And I've finished them off in the inside just with some pink cardstock. And I've put my stamp on the back because I know um Kay come on focus I know Kay wanted that so um that's those and then the little mini album thingy that we had to make like I say out of one um 12 by 12 sheet of cardstock again I just wanted it to tie in with these note cards really so again I've used the paper from the Paradise Crush um, collection and obviously use the same little flowers um, and the same stamp. Um, I'd seen other people had done this slightly differently. Um, they had theirs up this way round and they done this as a pocket um, that way and the flaps coming over. My take on this, I decided to do it like this. So you've got like photo mat here, here, oops, here, here and here. Or zoom out of it see my iron in there um, and then lift it up again another photo mat and then what I've done I've um, secured the other flap um, use my Martha Stewart decorative punch um, just to add a little edge on there and then these were some stitched re rectangles um, just for some little um, what do we call them? tags gosh I couldn't think this morning so uh, just done that. So hopefully she'll like that. And then that just folds and that just folds again. And like I say, that's your little mini album. So pop along to um, Kay's channel. That's Kazikins one over on Facebook. Lovely, lovely lady. Um, not only does she do paper crafts, but she's also a really lovely jewellery maker as well. She does some lovely, lovely beadwork. So pop along. And uh, Kay, if you're watching, this is my entry. It is on its way. Okay, I'll speak to you all soon. Thanks for watching. Bye.